What makes my tattoos look so three-dimensional is the use of light and shade within the nipple and the areola area itself. It's the use of softness around the edge. Although what I do is medical tattooing, I do see this as art. And each design is created for that particular individual. For my ladies, this tattoo treatment isn't about conforming to looking perfect or anything like that. This is essentially a restoration of something that's been taken away from them. I initially didn't think that it could be cancer. You know, I'm 32, um, I got married two years prior, I have two beautiful children. I had my whole life ahead of me. So when I had my mastectomy, they took out a oval shaped piece of my stomach and um, made it into a breast. The nipple sort of for me, it is like that badge of honor because you've got your scars that you, you wear proudly because you fought this battle. It's the, the last thing to be done to sort of give me back my confidence and feel more like a, a woman again. <laughs> Words couldn't describe how happy it's going to make me. No. <laughs> I'm OK. So I was 28 when I was diagnosed with being BRCA1 positive, which gave me a 95% chance of having breast cancer and ovarian cancer. After watching my mum go through cancer, and knowing that her mother died at quite an early age. So I didn't even want one chance that I was gonna to have to go through it myself. So um, in June last year, I had the double mastectomy and I chose to go straight to implants so that the recovery time isn't as much. My breasts now don't look like they did before. They look completely different and it was hard for me at first to accept that they actually were my breasts. So here, here's my, um, my scars. Um, I have one under both breasts um, and I've got a line up the front of each one where they took my nipples away. I'm hoping that when I have my tattoos they might actually make me feel like they are breasts again. I just know that once I've had this done I don't even need to worry about it anymore. My mastectomy side of it will be finished and done and then I can just move on to then get my hysterectomy done. Sensation-wise, are you feeling this side more or the other side more, would you say, so far? Um, I can't feel this at all. Really? Yeah. You can go and have a look in the mirror now when you're ready. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. That's so incredible. It's massive. I've now gone from just having lumps to nipples. They're boobs again now. They look absolutely fantastic, and I can't wait to get them out and show people. Hello. Oh, Hello. <laughs> Great surgery. <laughs> it's amazing, isn't it? I thought it was a death sentence. When I think of cancer now, power, strength, courage. Yeah, those are the words that come to mind now. OK, my well, lovely, do you want to stand up when you're ready? That looks awesome. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> It just looks all real now. <laughs> yeah. And as the redness and bruising goes, leaves you with the colour. I think Claire is an inspiration, really, and I would never be able to thank her enough. They've physically and emotionally been through such trauma, and to give them this final piece back is absolutely fantastic, and it means the world to me.